What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with season four, episodes six and seven of Demon Slayer. Remember to check out that Patreon if you guys want the full uncut early access versions to all the episodes and everything we put on the channel. Check out the Twitch if you guys want to watch these live with us before we even post it to Patreon. I'm not going to waste any more time. Let's hop right into today's episodes. Let's do it. All right. Exactly where we left off, starting Gyome's training. I do agree. Your core is very important to all aspects of athleticism. The strongest of the Demon Slayer core. Interesting. I hope they're talking about Gyome. <laughs> Cling to the boulders. It's not... <laughs> it's not a rock. It's a boulder. <laughs> he's waterboarding himself he's drowning in there oh shit was that murata i haven't seen murata in a grip i always enjoyed him in the, the spider mountain arc whatever that was you know That is Murata. I haven't seen my boy in a grip. He is the stone Hashira, so. It also is kind of crazy. Rosenitsu's <laughs> hilarious. Namu Amida Butsu. 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 Now we have to push the boulder. Remember when days were easier when we had to cut through boulders? Ah, it's way easier than pushing it. I like that transition from the boulder to the moon, though. I don't like this. With the... Yeah, what is the name of that instrument? He is looking all over. I love how big this area is. Bro, that's so cool. Even tearing his sandals. Ooh, he's making some onigiri? Wow, yeah, he has great form. I've tried a couple of times. They're super hard. I wonder if they're stuffed at all or just pure rice. Even just rice is fine. I do love me some onigiri, though. When you're the big brother of a, of a big family like he is, you gotta, you know, come on. Oh. Ah. Crispy rice with a nice fluffy rice in the middle. Eh. Miso flavored too. I need my man Tanjiro to be cooking up for me. All right. Tanjiro is such a good guy. He's a man I aspire to be like one day. W man's. Push that boulder. Push that shit. He really is pushing him so hard, bro. I wonder if there's like a trick to it. If there's a secret at all. Or if it's pure, just like literally the strength, this core, you know? Could be another breathing technique. I love their development and their friendship. Kenya was such an asshole when he first met him. 
What? See, I was like, maybe there's a secret. Namu Namu. Namu. Even just a, even an inch. I'll take that. That's even progress. A very long way to go. Picture the fam bam. I love that. Set your heart ablaze is such. Oh, I love that. Such a good word call back to my man Rengoku. I love the visualization of that being ablaze in his body. See, his mark changes. Oh, I love that. They're even shocked at the progress he's making. The repetitive motion. Over and over again. Minute after minute, hour after hour. My man is making some headway. That might be five feet, but that's insane. That was the end of the episode. Episode 7, Stone Hashira Gyome Himajima. I wonder if we're going to get his flashback. I wonder if we're going to see him fight. Hey, <laughs> man is literally exhausted, but you put in mad work, my boy. Wow, we did it. Wow. Shout out, Gyome. I always wonder what that scar is. Why does he cry? <laughs> w brothers. He was. Nezuko's a real one. He's very honest and humble. Wonder who he was called children. Wonder who he's thinking about. I do agree with that. I love that. Kamado Tanjiro. Kamado Tanjiro. Oh, are we gonna get a flashback? Is that a younger Gyome? Wow. Maybe like monk training? I do know those who are very concentrated, and such as those, can withstand the heat, the cold, hunger. Wait, isn't that not Zenitsu's boy? Not boy, he's Rosen Zenitsu, but the guy who was trained by the lightning, the Thunder Hashira. That's Zenitsu's boy. But he took... Yeah, I already wanted to whoop his ass from talking shit to my boy Zenitsu, but... Nah, yeah, I might need to whoop his ass. <laughs> I might need to whoop his ass. That's one thing I give Demon Slayer. It's not afraid to kill some kids. Yeah, that's dark as shit. 
I was one. I thought it was just purely a design choice to not have his pupils be drawn. I did not know he was blind. And it was her, the one who tried. Oh, bro, what the? And that's why he was thinking of her when he was just thinking of talking to. Bro, this is getting crazy. He gets frustrated just thinking about it. Man's fucking grappling with a demon, bruh. That's how he got the scar. Oh my god. Can Gyome. Did my man go fisticuffs with a demon and win? Nah, he might be the goat in the Demon Slayer core. He might be the goat. For the first time in his life, he's throwing punches, and we know how much of a peaceful and kind man he, you know, it was terrifying even to me. I thought eventually we'd get his backstory, but I did not think it'd be this. He was probably he was probably the monster. I don't know. Like, that's horrible. That is horrible. Yeah, I'm forever beefing with Zenitsu's boy. Yep, it's 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 on site when we see him. You never know what's underneath the surface, you know? When push comes to shove, their true nature emerges, but it makes much more sense why he's acknowledging Tanjiro, you know, after that story. That was a W story. Wow. That touched me. I love all that observation coming from a blind man. It hits. Like, Gyome might be my in my top three Hashi right now, I won't lie. It might be Giyu, Rangoku, Gyome. And then Tengen. I want to see him fight, though. I won't lie. That story was great. That's a great transition, but it hurts my heart, you know? God damn. Is he, is he asleep? Nope. I don't know if he's being jokey jokey or actually serious. Okay. Nice of him bringing him the fish and everything. He's like, do I keep going? Do I back up? Do I leave him alone? Do I push a little forward? What do I do? Oh yeah, what is the letter? Wonder if it has to do with the Thunder Hashira, his homeboy that I hate even more now. What was the letter? <laughs> Alright, Kiba, this ain't Fang over Fang. Chill out, buddy. You can tell he's getting faster. He's getting stronger. His reactions are getting better. I love how we can see the growth in him. That shit was badass. Okay, good. Maybe we can get some training done now. Definitely was a red bean mochi. He's just awkward guy. He was like, you know, I'm actually glad you came. A good way to win him over, I won't lie. It's a great idea. Why is Giyu being so cool all of a sudden? Huh? He was thankfully up. One, one of the Demon Slayers was able to catch these fucking eyes. And especially Sanami being one of the only ones who went to the Infinity Castle. Like He's like, what the fuck is going on? You should probably report that right away. 
I would literally already be running. Is my man Muzan going to Uba Yashiki's spot? Hey, did he find him? Oh no. I got goosebumps, I won't lie. They're giving him way too much presence right now. My man is literally Satan. Oh, that's dirty. That's dirty. Oh, you sons of fucking damn. All right, apparently we got a post credit scene. Oh, is it literally just him walking all swaggily? Is UFO table going OD with him? Oh, they're going OD with him. This motherfucker got swag. I'm not going to lie. I would expect this to be the finale. Like how this ends on the finale. Like, oh shit. This is how it's going to go down. We trained. Here it starts. But we have another 40 minute episode. Ubuyashiki. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I don't really know what to say because I'm more distraught about that cliffhanger and going into next episode because I know it's going to be insane. But all I, I, I do got to say this before we get into next week's episode. I love Guillaume. That story was tragic. It was also very touching. I love how that story relates to his feelings and emotions on Tanjiro, Nezuko, stuff like that. And I, I also like how... Zenitsu's boy plays in that story as well. I need to know more about him and I need to see him again. I need to know what was in Zenitsu's letter because like Oh, this is getting we're really hitting the climax. It feels like of Demon Slayer Like I know that like I said, there's gonna be three movies. It's gonna be the trilogy to end it all off I'm glad they're gonna be global releases and not Japan first and America eight years later, but like All I know is UFO table is gonna kill it with this finale Demon Slayer has been a staple for me for years seems weird that it feels like I just started it and it's already about to end relatively soon. I thoroughly enjoyed it though. Hopefully you guys did as well. If you did, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts below. Check out that Patreon. Come on over to the Twitch if you guys want to watch this live before it even is on Patreon. We're going to drink some water. Tell someone you love them. Have a great day, Dapper Squad.